When you see Prabhas on screen, what is it that draws your attention? The fear of reaction. How is he going to react on this? I can hold that for a while. You said that right? Bahubali, or Salar and Kalki are in the three of them. Have you ever wondered what it takes to become a pan-India superstar? No! Well, today, we are peeling back the curtain on one of the biggest names in Indian cinema. Prabhas. Whether you know him as Bahubali or are just curious about the magic behind his stardom, stick around because we are about to reveal why Prabhas is in a league of his own. What the hell? Prabhas' stardom and his epic movies that gave us a never-seen-before experience aren't exactly breaking news. On similar lines, saying that Prabhas has completely overshadowed the Khans wouldn't be fair either. After all, the Khans have dominated Bollywood for 30 years and keeping up to that level of consistency for three decades is no small feat. But if anyone today has the potential to surpass that stardom and rule the next few decades, it's got to be Prabhas. And it's not just about what Bahubali did for him. Sure, Bahubali was a game-changer for Prabhas and Rajamoli played a massive hand in his journey, but that's not the only reason for his stardom. Rajamoli worked with actors like Ram Charan and Jr. NTR in RRR, a movie that won an Oscar, but neither actor's fame is anywhere close to that of Prabhas. Even after box office failures like Saho, Radhesham and Adipurush, Prabhas' stardom had little to no impact. That's why in today's video, we'll look at all the factors that make Prabhas one of the biggest pan-India stars. Please watch the video till the end and in case I miss anything, let me know in the comments so I can hopefully cover them in future videos. Let's get started. A relatively unknown actor takes on a role so monumental that it doesn't just make waves, it creates a tsunami in the film industry. That's precisely what happened when Prabhas starred in Bahubali, making him the first true pan-Indian superstar. But how did he get there? Before Bahubali, Prabhas was already a youth sensation in the Telugu film industry. Whether it was the romantic action drama Varsham or the blockbuster success of Mirchi, Prabhas had emerged as one of the leading actors in Telugu cinema. In 2015, Bahubali Part 1 was released and there was no turning back for the rebel star. Bahubali wasn't just a national phenomenon, it received global acclaim. Prabhas's portrayal of Bahubali garnered him fans worldwide, making him a globally recognized figure in cinema. Post Bahubali, social media also played a crucial role in amplifying Prabhas's fame and connecting him with a global audience. The viral nature of social media content helped spread the word about his projects and endorsements, creating a buzz that transcended geographic boundaries. The bigger the scope, the bigger the budget, the bigger the brand of Prabhas became. The immense popularity and success of Bahubali skyrocketed Prabhas's market value. This success opened doors to diverse and ambitious projects, making him one of the highest paid actors in India. Films like Sao and Radhesham followed, allowing him to explore different genres and expand his repertoire. Even though both these movies received mixed reviews, their box office collections managed to recover their overall budgets. His 2023 movie, Adi Purush, grossed over 350 crores Indian rupees, which is higher than the all-time hits of many A-list actors. This underscored Prabhas's star power and his ability to draw audiences. In an era where actors struggled to make an overall box office collection of 100 crores, Prabhas has 500 plus crore opening films worldwide, with the last four happening after the success of Bahubali. Production houses and big budget banners are eager to invest in Prabhas because of the substantial return on investment he guarantees. The value proposition of Prabhas hasn't dipped, and with movies like Spirit, Salar Part 2, and Kalki Part 2 lined up, the brand value of Prabhas is expected to keep growing. Alright, let's get back to the video. What is it about Prabhas that has fans from every corner of the country cheering his name? Is it his dedication, his versatility, or maybe it's something even more basic, like humility? While humility is a personal trait and can vary widely even within industries, Prabhas's approach to fame and interaction with fans and media is distinctly grounded and humble. This trait sets him apart not just in the Telugu film industry, but also in comparison to many Bollywood actors. Prabhas is often described as down-to-earth and approachable by his fans and colleagues. Despite his immense popularity, he maintains a low profile and is known to interact with fans and the media without any airs. In interviews, Prabhas comes across as shy and reserved, steering clear of controversy and gossip, focusing more on his work and often giving credit to his team and co-stars rather than boasting about his own achievements. She was very good. We were all shocked. Seeing the humility of Prabhas and other actors from South India, it does beg the question, does Bollywood need a culture shift to better connect with its audience? Prabhas is often a director's top choice for several compelling reasons. First, he has showcased a remarkable range in his acting repertoire. 
from playing the intense and powerful bahubali to the calm and sophisticated protagonist in films like mirchi and darling he has proven his ability to adapt to diverse roles this versatility makes him a valuable asset for directors looking to explore different genres and storytelling styles drama always works and uh, it works especially with uh, prabhas yeah. prabhas is known for his extraordinary commitment to his roles for instance he dedicated nearly 5 years to the bahubali series this level of dedication ensures that directors get the best out of them knowing they will go to great lengths to bring their visions to life prabhas possesses a commanding screen presence and natural charisma that captivates audiences his ability to hold the viewers attention and portray emotions convincingly adds step to the characters he plays enhancing the overall impact of the film he has a very unique way of turning around and watch, looking at people from playing the role of a rebellious lover in varsham to embodying the larger than life warrior in the epic bahubali series pramas has consistently showcased his range as an actor Post Bahubali he continued to experiment and expand his horizons with films like Saho and Radhesham Saho received mixed reviews but it highlighted his ability to carry a massive action entertainer on his shoulders his penchant for experimentation reached its peak with Adi Purush which can only be called a disaster and nothing else Gajab be jati hai Even then Pravas didn't stop delivering diverse experiences to audiences in Salar he made a massive box of his comeback and his performance was remembered for its emotional and raging appeal in Kalki 28980 He showed us traits of both goofiness and anger along with subtle moments of emotional reactions that left audiences craving for more. The stardom of Prabhas is so generous that even though his character Bhairava was getting beaten up by Ashwathama, fans accepted it because they knew what he brought to the film. Raja Saab Pano Prabhas's releases in 2025 is touted to be the actor's biggest risk yet. And given his filmography, this doesn't come as a surprise. This constant experimentation not only keeps his fans eagerly anticipating his next move, but also solidifies his position as a dynamic and groundbreaking actor in Indian cinema. If you are a Prabhas Gauru fan like me, you need not worry because Prabhas's upcoming films are some of the most highly anticipated films in Indian cinema, with the potential to create significant box office impact, big budgets, massive scale, and never seen before experience. It's all there. Salar Part 2, Kalki Part 2, Raja Saab, Kanappa and Spirit are confirmed projects with the latter being directed by Sandeep Reddy Wanga and we all know what he can do. I made a whole video on this subject. Feel free to check it out. The link is in the description. Other than these there are reports of Bahubali 3, KGF 3 and L10 with the latter being Lokesh Kannagaraj's last film. Each film targets different genres and audiences ensuring a broad appeal. Pravas's ability to draw in crowds combined with the directorial prowess and innovative storytelling of these projects positions them to break box office records potentially. Coming to final thoughts. Pravas's journey from a budding actor to a pan-Indian superstar is a testament to his talent, hard work and the transformative power of cinema. Bahubali was a catalyst that elevated him to unparalleled heights, but his continued success is driven by his dedication to his craft and his ability to connect with audiences, making him arguably the biggest pan-Indian superstar in Indian cinema. If you enjoyed this breakdown, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe for more videos like these. Until next time, stay tuned and keep watching.